All right, class, what's going on? We're on week five. It's awesome. We're getting uh, about a third of the way through the semester. I'm getting excited. Um, so today's assignment, we were supposed to try and find an example of an anticipatory breach. So the case that we found um, is the following. Yahoo Inc. recently entered a $4.8 billion deal with Verizon Communications to sell its core business. However, two years ago, Yahoo Inc. apparently suffered a security breach which was discovered after the merger. Uh, Yahoo Inc. now is unsure if they want to sell the, the core business to Verizon, but Verizon still wants to buy the business after some investigations. So the reason why we think that this is an example of an, of an anticipatory breach is because Yahoo basically already agreed to sell the company uh, or the, the core business, if you will, to uh, Verizon, but after finding some things out, Yahoo isn't like, hey, they're like, hey, we don't want to sell the business anymore. But Verizon's like, well, you already had a contract with us that you would. So they're breaching the contract by basically saying, We're, we don't have the intent of giving it to you anymore. Um, so yeah. All right. Our quiz question for this week is Yahoo Inc. made a deal with Verizon Communications to sell their core business for $4.8 billion. However, Prior to the deal, Yahoo had a security breach, uh, which made Yahoo Inc. decide not to sell the business as agreed. Uh, what form of contract breach is this? And of course, as we were saying, our, our correct answer is the anticipatory breach, um, because uh, Yahoo Inc. already agreed to sell the business and later backed out of the deal um, before they were supposed to make it. Um, one of, our first wrong answer is uh, material breach. Um, and this is just because there was no information withheld from the company, and which I wouldn't tell the material breach. So our wrong answer number two is a minor breach, which is almost the same thing as a material breach, uh, just to a lesser degree. Um, so there, again, the reason why that's uh, not the answer is because no information in minute or large quantity was withheld from any of the companies. And our, our final wrong answer is none of the above. And the reason why is because there obviously is a form of breach that has occurred in this uh, in this case. So, anticipatory breach. All right. I hope you guys uh, enjoyed the video and you do well on the exam.